following illustration is for demonstration purposes only. Please don't try this at home so we can keep our skies safe and oceans clean. If you were to let a helium balloon go on a calm day, it would float up. The flight path it would take would be straight up. On a windy day, however, the balloon would drift with the wind and follow a flight path that is angled compared to the ground. When an aeroplane takes off on a calm day, the angle between its flight path and the ground is called the angle of climb. Just like the balloon that drifted with the wind, when an aeroplane takes off into the wind, its angle of climb is steeper and the ground roll is shorter. Taking off into wind is particularly useful to aeroplanes as it helps them avoid obstacles such as trees on the ground. The reason the ground roll is shorter is that when the aeroplane is taking off into the wind, its takeoff ground speed is lower. For example, both aeroplanes will take off at the same airspeed. Let's assume it's 60 knots. The aeroplane taking off in nil wind will have a takeoff ground speed of 60 knots. But the aeroplane taking off into a 20 knot headwind will have a takeoff ground speed of 40 knots. Both aeroplanes will reach the same altitude in the same amount of time. Altitude gained with respect to time is called the rate of climb. For example, if both aeroplanes will reach 1000 feet in 2 minutes, their rate of climb is 500 feet per minute.